I don't want to be a victim to the world. I'm not just a celebrity. I have a real life and I make mistakes like everybody. Girl, who the f is you? Let me get a mother fish filet. Okay. Oh, Power afraid to punch that f out window if I don't give a filet. We all make mistakes. I am becoming a star and they still talk about my past. Really, I love when a nigga me. With the with my on me. I'm out. Let me in your mouth in your face. She belongs to the streets. Suck it, Hannah. The children will be destroyed because the weak has been empowered. Done on purpose so that the community is in chaos. It would look like I'm in chaos mentally up here. But I'm just saying, it's like, yo, let me tell you something. When you have women in a community who feel like there's no repercussions to the dirt they do, the community cannot thrive. Ooh, everybody, everybody, did some holiday. Hey, I am growing just like everybody else. Hey, everybody know me. I'm viral. I'm everywhere. People need to accept Sukihana because I'm still a human. So she Women did it by herself. Women are allowed to destroy. She and did. what else would they do? Because they have no power to do anything else. The people in okay. charge of this United States, or whatever you want to call it, empower first. So that the community is ran by hers. A while ago, I had signed a contract and I didn't know nothing about the business. You know, and I'm realizing that I signed my soul. I, I sold my soul to the devil. I signed my soul to the devil. I don't even own myself no more. I don't know if God can get me out of this, you know? And Look at everything that's happening in the world. People might think I got this tough skin, but I still have regrets. Cut the cameras, this is real. Oh, the thing is, I'm a disgusting person, so it's okay. just like, people been knew that about me. I don't give a f But what do you I, say to them that say she's a terrible representation for black women? I Stop tell, posting her. She's disgusting. She just exploits herself for clout. Whatever you heard about me is the truth. Uh -huh. I don't give a f People like to put a lot of expectations on me. I'm, I'm a hood girl. Greetings, you polite savages, and welcome to another Tip Talk. Accountability is one of the things that, as a people and as a country, we have a problem with. We don't understand the cause and effect, you know, but by doing something in one place, it, it can cause a chaos in your life in another place. And that is why discipline is so very important for all aspects of success. Enter Sukiana. Sukiana has had an amazing run. She's on television shows. She has a musical career and she is very vulgar in her approach to music and life. Now, listen. You cannot be in a public eye doing vulgarities and expect not to be criticized. One would even say you would expect the criticism to come. For instance, doing this YouTube business, criticism comes all the time, whether it's your videos not good enough, uh, you're, you're doing the same subject, you're picking on this person, you're too harsh, not harsh enough. Nobody's ever totally happy and that's okay. Your job is to create a quality product, but also represent yourself in the best way possible. And it seems like Sukiyana understands she's not representing herself. I mean, in this clip, you hear her, you see her crying, saying that everyone does bad things in the past. That's not what she used. But, you know, paraphrasing, everyone does bad things in the past, but I'm, I, I'm a celebrity and I want to grow and I want to move on. But here is the problem that we have, ma'am. You cannot, on one side of your mouth, talk reckless about how you don't care and how you only represent yourself and how you don't care how people look at you. Then on the other side of your mouth, turn around and cry. Ma'am, that's lack of accountability and it is attention-getting behavior. We all reap what we sow. We are all responsible for the decisions we make, positive and negative. We are all responsible for the walks of life that we go down. I mean, as so, soon as you're an adult, you are responsible for yourself. And there's only so long that you can put it on your parents. It's only so long that you can put it on your upbringing. There's only so long that you can put it on your environment. It's your job to persevere and overcome. And it seems like Sukiana's done a great job of overcoming, but a horrible job of understanding what comes with her choices she made to overcome her circumstance. Part in my man. I love to fart by my man. Bill, don't I fart around you all the time? I f my man more. Probably have like one day to go get f I want a beat the Mario coins out this a Yeah. Woo! So I probably only got like 
one day to get real crazy. <laughs> yep, the Mario coin. Hit the bills like you better sell that cat. That's how they when they late on the rib. Like that's your claim to fame. The story she tell about who she is. Mm. I suck more than in the cold. But your baby daddy gonna pay my rent. Pop that cat. If your bills like you better sell that cat. If your bills like you better sell that cat. I'm about to get on my I'm about to get my lit. The little ugly. Because she ugly in the mother. I found a picture of her without the makeup on. That's her ugly. To my ugly red? No, not ugly red. Not ugly red. I'm talking about the other. Oh, you talking about the ugly red? Yeah, that's ugly red. Yeah, that's ugly red. 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 It's <laughs> going that ugly with somebody for real. Damn, Corey going in on poor Sukiyana. Now, I don't think Sukiyana looks as bad as Corey claims, but she does remind me of Baby Bop. Anyway, I want to show you guys this next series of clips with the loop de loop logic of Sukiyana and this new affliction affecting this cohort of modern women. We know this asinine logic transcends and applies to all race of westernized women. Just go on TikTok and podcasts and any of these places to find this with modern women running away from reality of their bad choices as they are bumbling in their attempt to erase their past indiscretions and force you to accept me as I am as she explored her sexuality during her hot girl summer. And if you don't accept her for her past, then you, my friend, are labeled as too insecure to handle her extensive and expansive history. Flashback. The people that are judging Britney Renner for saying that she slept with 35 men, she's living in her truth. Y'all think that look don't count as a body and it does. I count it, because I love little A lot of y'all think that money, getting paid to don't count as a body, it don't count. What? <laughs> hey, my choice, my body, my body, my body. Choice. Did my career, my um, Yasmin Penn Davis thing, and she only has 52 titles, honey. She's not loose, so that's a long. So you know that that's a lot of question. years. Personal body count is low. I don't consider work. It don't matter. The work body don't count. Don't count. No. What? That's that's business. Me, the woman, her body count is low. But the star, yeah, she outside. What? The problem with that is you're two different names, but the same body. It don't matter. It's two different personas. What is your major malfunction, num nut? <laughs> Shout out to the DEA. Delusional, entitled, ambivalent women. <laughs> I just need to come out and tell the world the truth about me. They hiding bodies, people. This is double speak. Speak in a way that deceives or confuses to hide the truth. If it's little D, it don't count. If he's too short, it don't count. If he's too ugly, it don't count. If he's too broke, it don't count. If it's for work activities, it don't count. It don't count when she says it don't count, even though the risking of STIs and a baby is a reality she can't escape. I don't know about you fellas out there, even if a woman's been fat, below average, broken, on the crazy side, I still gotta count them as a notch under my belt. Now just imagine the places were switched and we men didn't count less desirable women as counting. Just imagine the outcry if we talked about the ladies the same way. Sukiyana and women like her is the embodiment of the wishy-washiness, the flip-flop mentality, ambivalent attitude of Marvin women. So Corey, can a leopard really change its spot? Her options are gone and they are trying to let her be a better person. But in so many cases, they never wind up being nothing but who they are. They rarely can be something better than what they know, than what they've seen. It's hard to jump up out of that and become something that's going against the grain and heading toward the good. I wish everybody to one day meet somebody who really is about something. Because when you got somebody who about something, you're not going to let her hang herself. In fact, you're going to stand in front of her and let everybody know this one right here, this a winner. Don't come at her foul. You know, I was once told by a wise woman once, there are no such things as born again virgins. What these ladies are attempting to do is rationalize their bad decisions and for you to accept those bad decisions in exchange for your resource, your money, time, energy, and mental tranquility. This is not a good deal. One minute they are proclaiming loud and proud on the rooftops and social media, my body, my choice, and can sleep with whoever they want. Then the next minute, then she'll delete that mistake when she feels shameful and regretful about sleeping with a man that's undesirable to her or She's just doing it for the money. Considering the law of society and social media is working in your favor, 
Man can't put our heads in the sand and ignore red flags of your past behavior and your history. Doing so would be naive and foolish for a man because it is costly to a man like alimony, child support, taking care of a child that's not his. So all the amount of rationalization excuse you make to explain your long history and actions will always be in the back of our minds. There will always be trade-offs for what you want and what you will quote unquote settle for ladies because just like Sukiyana, you ladies will all of a sudden Three weeks later I want to be a strong person and it hurts so I made a mistake It just hurts me so much With this toxic westernized thought process, they will rationalize and justify their past because they can't bear with the responsibility, the weight, literally, take that as you may, of their past transgressions and behavior. This cognitive dissonance happens when these ladies are dealing with the conflict between their sexual liberation and the standards of what a man demands for a long-term relationship leading to marriage. Women like this deal with the discomfort of their actions as they feel the shame, embarrassment, and judgment from social pressure. Men take notice how Sukiyan and women like her will experience anxiety, regret, shame, stress, and lash out in anger and indignation by what we men have been trying to tell them the whole time and how to attain, maintain, and retain a man for the long run and for the ring, meaning his protection and provision. So Ms. Sukiyana, when you're here crying, when you're here saying that you you want people to forget your past, do not forget that your immediate past, your immediate past, just this year, you were uh, vulgarity talking about you're getting stretched out and uh, eating some uh, tossing salads in, in, in England. I'm trying to get my she stretched and eating we be eating Today in London. Don't forget that you were saying, hey, you're baby mamas and, and you just didn't care how people made them look bad and who cares how you look and how you like dirty things done to you and everything in our mind about disgusting. Think of you because it is true. But then you can't say that, then turn around and start crying when people look at you bad. This is bipolar behavior. We all understand that everybody has emotions and everybody wants to be looked at in a positive light. However, you cannot act like you don't care, then turn around and tell everybody you care just to act like you don't care again. You have very weird uh, temperaments and very weird behavior sandwiched together and nobody gonna feel sorry for you. Ma'am, here's the bottom line. You chose to live this way and to make money. We understand that. You chose to make money the way you did it. Just like Tariq said, you know, just like Tariq said about Sexy Red, you was gonna be out there thotting it up anyway, so you might as well have thotting it up for money. Okay, cool, but you have to stop acting like you're a victim. Ma'am, you are not a victim. You are doing this to yourself. I need a jealous to pull up. The hood rats, all the real, all the trill. I ain't got time for none of that classy These so man i need to be around the people that love what good you know the old school attitude was put your best foot forward the old school attitude was you understood you reap what you sowed now you can look at it and say all that old stuff don't matter but of, of course it does because you are reaping what you sow you know just in due time and a change ain't gonna come about you unless you change it about you but can you change it about you and still be the popularity and the, the attention and the money that you desire? As far as this music stuff, I won't be doing this music stuff anymore. I started this because this is my dream. I just want to tell everybody I'm sorry. I just made the biggest mistake that I ever made. Don't let the person that you signed it to pick the attorney. Because I mean the attorney working for them. I hear people all the time saying they do ratchet stuff and they wouldn't care as long as they was getting paid. And this is such a stupid attitude because guess what you're gonna outlive your celebrity if you're lucky you're gonna outlive your celebrity and when you outlive your celebrity you're gonna have to look back and look in the mirror and ask yourself was it worth it but ladies you may think i'm against your past honestly personally i don't care because i like it that you play loose more easy for me more fun for you it's a good deal all around but just know the calculations will be made costs and benefits trade-offs and opportunities you can't have have it all ladies that's all i got for you polite savages as always like and subscribe just ask yourself one burning question can you handle the tip boom we're out <laughs> we found true happiness